Hello everyone! In this lesson, we will learn how to skew elements horizontally or vertically using the skew function. The skew function is like the translate and scale functions, meaning we have skew x to skew elements horizontally and skew y to skew them vertically. Or we can just use skew and the first value will be x and the second one will be y. Now, skew is similar to rotate in terms of units. We use degrees to determine how much the element should be skewed. Good. Now let's see how it works in action. I will go right here and add transform skew x, let's say 30 degrees. And now when I go to the browser and hover over the image, you can see it skews horizontally by 30 degrees. And we can change the skew direction by using negative values. So let's try that. I'll go back to my CSS and make this minus 30. And now, when I hover over it, it should be skewed in the other direction. Now, let's skew the image vertically using the skew y function. I'll go back to our code editor and then change this x to y. And now, when I hover over the image, you can see it skewed vertically. And, to make it skew vertically in the opposite direction, we can go back and remove the minus to make it positive. And when I hover over it again, it'll skew on the other side. Now, as we said, we can skew HTML elements both horizontally and vertically at the same time, using just skew, which accepts two values. The first one is for x, and the second one is for y. So I'll go back to my code editor and make this just skew. And then make it skew by 20 degrees horizontally and 40 degrees vertically. And now, when I hover over it, you can see it skewing in both directions. Please subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you will be notified with my latest videos and updates.